Bitcoin has officially passed its all-time high and even though it was just for a bit, this is still huge news. It looks like there's still a lot of sell orders and resistance near the top, but here's what's important. Each dip becomes smaller and smaller, so it's only a matter of time before we break through. It's my job to figure out how to take advantage of this market and this time I'm bringing you another social fly banger with huge potential. Today's project is a decentralized AI social protocol with data mining features that could be the web3 version of whatsapp if this is your first time here my name is summer i talk about all things crypto and share my personal strategies to win big in this next bull run you can gain access to this information before everyone else and much more by joining my free discord and newsletter which are linked in the description below before we get started don't forget to like subscribe and most importantly hit that shiny bell notification button it really helps the channel more than you think and i really appreciate it and as always please remember that none of this is financial advice all right let's get started Started. So if you haven't heard about social fly, let me quickly go over it. So it's essentially a fusion between social media and web3, often with some financial elements tied in. The goal is to build an ecosystem with incentives for those who interact with the project by doing things like chatting, creating posts, reacting to posts, building groups, and more. So imagine tweeting 5,000 times a day like you normally do, but this time it's earning you crypto for it. That's what social fly's vision is. So what's today's project? Well, it's called the chat a decentralized web3 chat tool where users can talk to each other and discover and trade digital assets directly in app through inscription technology which is a technical process of embedding data like a message into the smallest denomination of a chain's coin for example brc20 inscriptions are done with a satoshi or a sat where one bitcoin is made up of 100 million sats in dchat's case they're doing inscriptions on the binance smart chain they're the largest social file inscription on the bnb chain right now so let's Let's go over the main features of dchat so to start you're gonna need to download the app and log in thankfully they take advantage of the decentralized id system which will let you log in just by using your wallet then you're able to create your profile and you can even use nfts as a form of identification the other bonus of nfts is that they let you enter private chat rooms for holders of specific nfts allowing projects to build their community in dchat as for the meat and potatoes, DChat offers seamless peer-to-peer -peer communication with a sleek interface and messaging features like direct secure communication channels, group chats, files, images, videos, push notifications, voice messages, voice calls, video calls, and even group video calls. For security, all of this is also fully encrypted. Aside from the added security bonus of being a decentralized protocol, DChat has end-to-end -end encryption, metadata encryption, and data storage encryption. The way it works is through their client edge blockchain architecture. So basically, DChat uses nodes to move messages and other data from end-to-end -end without relying on servers. And they use private keys to encrypt and decrypt data across Cross nodes and they make sure to only store highly private data directly on the user's client meaning it's stored locally on your device so if you're looking to try dchat it's compatible across multiple platforms like ios web android and more all right now we've got a good understanding of the project and its main features but who is the team behind it and who's backing it well they're all doxxed and visible in the dchat white paper the ceo james radford has a bachelor's degree from the university of hawaii and has a lot of experience in the blockchain industry as well as the messenger industry he works as a product solutions advisor with block plus and has also worked with wechat the massive chinese messenger app the chief marketing officer andy dimitri handles market management and operations and finally the chief operations officer daniel drescher handles resource expansion and partnerships across the blockchain industry as for backers there are some familiar names supporting dchat including the dexcheck ape terminal pools chain gpt and solidus launchpad Finceptor, Alpha Capital, New Tribe Capital, Coinvestor, and even a Saudi royal fund. That's right, their advisor is Mohammed Jamal Al Qasimi, a prince of the Qasimi royal family in the UAE. His family manages up to $700 billion in assets. Dicha has also announced some big partnerships on their Twitter, including one with Mint Labs, the cross chain NFT minting protocol, and they also announced that Dicha is live on Manta Network as well as Injective. So, with that being said, let's dive into the tokenomics. The token is called DChat and it has a supply of 25 million tokens. The coin can be used for governance, which lets users vote on major decisions for the project, earning airdrops for partnered projects, and creating spaces for users to join. DChat has burned functions too.
too. Users are required to spend DChat tokens by bringing them in order to open live broadcasts, public meeting rooms, and receive verified checkmarks for their community. Aside from burning, you can also stake your DChat and earn 300% APR if you stake for a year. If you're looking for shorter staking periods, the team says they're launching more staking options in the future. But there is one other option, you can stake a minimum of 100 DChat into the validator vault. The way this works is that 1000 DChat mines you 1 credit per second and 730,000 credits will net you 1 AI NFT that you can mint in the future. With these NFTs, you're able to claim rewards from DChat's social data mining nodes and the team says that this stake DChat will be locked for 18 days and there is a 14% fee that will be shared to other stakers or will be burned. Not only that, but DChat has super nodes available to those who stake at least 10,000 tokens. These will give holders access to annual mining pool dividends and bonus referral rewards. Now, I know 10,000 tokens might seem like a lot, but DChat has some chat tier and features that should help. You can earn 0.1 DChat every time you complete a daily check-in, and if you're active enough that your daily activity index hits 20, you can earn 1 DChat per day from engagement. Aside from that, you can invite friends and other Web3 projects to the ecosystem to earn even more rewards. And there's a 10 DChat new user reward for those who register and stake 1,000 DChat for the first time. Now, let's jump into my favorite part, the price action. So DChat is sitting at around the $2 range with a market cap of just under $6 million. It had an all-time high of $2.44 back on the 3rd of March. We're still in the discovery phase since the coin is fairly new, but this is definitely one I'm going to be keeping my eyes on. And as this project develops, we'll have a better idea of what the future could hold. And speaking of the future, let's cover the roadmap to get a better feel for the team's vision. So by the end of this quarter, the team is focusing on privacy and performance. They aim to launch multi-chain support, metadata protection, and DChat Pay, which is their payment tool. In Q2 and Q3, the focus is on full decentralization. The team is planning to launch NFTs for their edge nodes that are used to transfer messages and other data from user to user. An iOS widget and a DChat card which I would love to know more information about. And finally, by Q4, the team wants to launch their main net, become fully open source, and bring incentives for node operators. So overall, I think this project does have potential, but we definitely haven't seen SocialFi truly come into the spotlight as much as other narratives have yet. So I will be keeping a finger on the pulse for this project to see what updates they drop in the future. And that's all, folks. If you're interested in getting in on DChat, I'll have all of the project links as well as the exchange links all listed in the description below. If you want to see more social social five videos feel free to let me know in the comments below and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel remember the crypto space comes with high risk and none of this is financial advice i highly recommend that you do your own research before deciding to invest hope you guys enjoyed the video see you in the next one